Hey everyone, welcome to another video. It's John Lee here, CEO and mortgage broker at Arise Mortgage. We're continuing our series for people who are looking to become a mortgage broker. And we're currently inviting and interviewing new brokers to join our team. And we'd love to connect with you to see if you are a good fit. One question I get asked from people considering to become a mortgage broker is, what are characteristics of a successful mortgage broker? That is a great question because everyone is gifted with different skills and if you have these skills, being a mortgage broker may be a natural fit for you. So let's dive into it. Being in the mortgage industry and meeting many successful mortgage brokers, I find that they are generally sociable and have excellent people skills. Do you like meeting new people? Do people generally like you? If you are not in a career that doesn't require you to have a network of people, would you still go out to different parties and networking events? Do you have a good sizable friends list on Facebook and followers on Instagram? If you do, you're a natural with wanting to make connections. Now notice that in addition to being sociable, you also need to have good people skills. One indicator of whether you have excellent people skills is the variety of personalities that are in your circle of friends and how close you are with them. For me, I have people who are super outgoing and people who are shy. And despite them being very different, I am able to be just as close with them. It's because of people skills. I am able to be like a chameleon and adapt and mirror the other person so that they can feel comfortable talking to me. Now take this same skill and use it with clients. The ability to connect and be close with a wider range of clients will allow you to build relationships faster and easier. Another characteristic of a successful mortgage broker is being authentic. One good indicator of this is whether your social media reflects who you are in real life. It's their unique brand and they are proud of it. They don't need to fake it until you make it. The mortgage industry relies heavily on trust. Think about it. Now, clients are sending you their SIN number, IDs, pay stubs, bank statements, and so on. If clients find you fake, they won't trust you and they will go with someone else. Also, clients can smell BS from very far away. If you're being fake and think you can get away with it, well, I hope you're very good at acting then. Stay true to yourself and be authentic and you will attract people who you like working with and vice versa. Next is they are usually really good at communicating. If you are comfortable with talking on the spot, teaching, explaining complex things and being able to dumb it down to a five-year-old, and understand it, that's a good sign you are an excellent communicator. Another way to see if you are good with communication is how good you are at storytelling. If someone asks you, oh, share with us an unforgettable moment on your vacation, are you able to tell the story so well that the other person can actually feel like they experienced what you experienced? Being a mortgage broker requires you to teach, deliver good news, and bad news when your file goes sideways. Now, how good are you with communicating the status of the file? Are you going to hide behind the phone and computer and you know, send them a text or an email? Or will you pick up the phone, call, and explain to them without a script? You need to pick up the phone and talk to them regardless of the news because that shows you care and the way you deliver can also show empathy to the client. If it's bad news, it's even more important to call your clients. Now, no one wants to receive bad news over a text. Now, do you want to break up with someone over a text or email? No. So likewise, communication is key to ensure everyone involved in the mortgage process is on the same page. Mortgage brokers are generally very organized and rely heavily on having a system in place. If you're a successful mortgage broker, chances are you're handling many files all at the same time. You need to be organized, not just for your work, but also outside of work as well. Your home 
is a direct relation or reflection of your mind. If your home is neat and tidy, it shows that your mind is clear. If your home is messy, it's a reflection of your mind that's filled with clutter. You're not thinking straight, you're not sharp. Mortgage brokers love being organized and having good systems in place so that we can monitor and be on top of each file better and nothing slips through the crack. And being resourceful is also another characteristic. Our industry changes so often. There are so many lenders out there and oftentimes we may not have the answers for everything. That's okay though. It's not about knowing and memorizing but where can you find the answer? Who will you talk to? Being resourceful is so important because it also allows you to sharpen up your skills and learn in the process. You may also find answers that require you to react and adapt to new changes and so on. It's a how can I mentality versus oh I can't or I don't know or I don't want to think. Know where to look or who to talk to to find answers. And lastly, mortgage brokers are generally confident. Not in an arrogant way, but we know what we're good at, our strengths, and we are confident that if we say we can do it, it'll be done. Clients love confidence. Can you imagine dealing with someone who you should trust, but they're not confident? Now imagine going to see your doctor, and after sharing with him or her your problem, the doctor doesn't seem or sound confident in their diagnosis. Now, chances are the next thing you're going to do right away is to book another appointment with another doctor for a second opinion. Confidence is important so that clients can trust your advice and know that what you are suggesting is the best course of action. If you have many of these characteristics and be honest with yourself, chances are you'll be a natural at becoming a mortgage broker. We have some openings coming up and we would like to invite you to submit your resume and cover letter if you want to apply. Unlike other brokerages, we don't just accept anyone though. You'll need to show us that you are a qualified candidate who will be fully committed and trainable. In exchange, I'm going to train you to ensure you will become a successful mortgage broker. The training consists of a 90-day intensive training. It consists of morning routines, mortgage brokering skills, and how to do a file from beginning to end, and sales skills. You're welcome to connect with other brokers on our team to see how they found the training. If you are interested in joining our team, apply by submitting your resume, and let's get started.